Today I want to be showing you how to connect your iPad to your desktop so that you can use your iPad as a document camera. Now why would you want to do that? Well your iPad has a whole, a whole lot better of a camera on it than your old document camera does. Besides that, all the old document cameras are going away. They're obsolete and so we no longer support them. So that's why you have this that you'll be able to use as a document camera. So how do you do that? How do you get connected? Well, the first thing is on your desktop computer, you'll see in the bottom right hand corner down here, this little arrow. You'll select that arrow and you'll see this icon right here. And this program is called Air Server Connect. So if you do not see this icon on your desktop here in the bottom, then please let us know so we can get this software installed for you. Once you're there, you just right mouse click select QR code Air Server Connect and it's going to bring up a QR code. Now what you will do is you'll come over to your iPad and you will select the Air Server Connect icon. Select that icon then you will select scan QR code. When you do that it's going to open up your camera and you simply take your iPad you hold it up to your screen and it's going to connect by reading that QR code and you'll know you're connected when you see this green check right here letting you know that you have established that communication. So you'll press the home button on the iPad with the updates it's the right corner right hand top corner you'll pull down and you'll see this screen come up says air mirroring screen mirroring so you will select screen mirroring now you will select the name of the computer that you're attached to and now you will see on your screen that we are now connected to our iPad. If I want to use my iPad now all I have to do is select camera and now everything that my camera sees it shows up now on my desktop computer. That is how you connect your iPad to your desktop to use it as a document camera. Now you'll notice I can take my two fingers and I can zoom in, zoom out as well. So that's how you do it. Now the couple of things to remember is this. One, make sure that your iPad is on Wi-Fi. And so you'll know that it's on Wi-Fi by simply at the top corner of your iPad as I zoom in here you'll be able to see this icon right there. That icon will let you know that hey you are connected to Wi-Fi and everything's good to go. The other thing to remember is this if you log out of your computer if you restart your computer you're going to have to bring up the QR code once again to scan it so anytime you lose connection you're going to have to rescan that barcode to establish that connection that is it. If you have any problems, feel free to contact technology, put in a help box ticket, or if you just need more training on how to use this or other cool ideas about using your iPad with this as a document camera, feel free to reach out to me, contact me, and I'll be more than happy to set up a time to come spend with you and walk you through all the ins and outs of using your iPad. I hope you're having a great day. hope you're having a great year. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.